In this video, I'll show you how you can coat pennies with a beautiful silver colored plate that'll last for years. The coating is made of tin, which is a silver colored metal. To set up the experiment, you'll first need to add about 20 to 30 milliliters of 0.1 molar sodium hydrogen sulfate solution to an evaporating dish. Next, add 0.9 grams of tin 2 chloride dihydrate. It's helpful to add some sodium dodecyl sulfate, about 75 milligrams here, but this step is optional. Next, add 4 grams of granular tin. The mixture should be heated until it simmers. Then add some pennies. Before you add the pennies, it's best to shine them up by buffing them with some steel wool to get them nice and clean. It takes about 10 to 15 minutes for the tin to plate onto the pennies. It's actually an interesting chemical reaction that goes on. The tin atoms in the grains of tin lose two electrons, and this forms tin ions that dissolve into the mixture. The two electrons go into the surface of the penny, and the dissolved tin ions then gain these two electrons on the surface of the penny, and they plate out as tin metal. The reaction happens because the tin atoms bind more strongly to the copper atoms in the penny than they do to each other in the grains of tin. After about 10 minutes of this reaction taking place, the result is a beautiful silvery coat on the surface of the pennies. Here you can see some of the tin coated pennies I made with an uncoated penny in the middle for comparison. In a previous video, I showed how to coat pennies with zinc. This also gives a silver colored coat, but the coat of zinc wears off in just a few weeks. On the other hand, this tin coat should last for several years. I'm going to try heating one of these tin coated pennies to form bronze. Bronze is an alloy, a mixture of copper and tin, and it has a golden color. Hey, it looks like it worked. Here you can compare the colors of the various pennies. A golden colored bronze penny on the left, a regular penny in the middle, and three tin coated pennies. In 2020, my wife and I celebrated our 25th wedding anniversary, and this is also known as the silver anniversary. To celebrate, I decided to use this experiment to code a penny dated with each year from 1995 to 2020 to celebrate all 25 years of our silver wedding anniversary. I know the pennies are really coated with tin and not silver, but they sure do look silvery enough to me and my wife enjoyed the small gift idea. Hey, be sure to leave a question or a comment if you try this experiment out for yourself. Happy experimenting!